Oh, welcome friends. We have a requirement to load a multiple files in a single file with the help of Talent Open Studio. So you can see we have a directory there which is containing a multiple file having the same format. And we want to append all the data in a single file. So we have a Talent Studio and uh, in Talent Studio we are using T file list. T file list uh, provides a capability to us to iterate all the files one by one. So here there are some settings in T file list one one number one directory so that is the current directory path where our file are located then file type you can see there is a file and directory suppose that uh, there are some files which are under the subdirectory in the same location so you can choose the subdirectory or both directories or both so and the third option is including subdirectory case sensitive and generate error if no file found that means if you want to include subdirectory you can select this option then global expression as file mask unchecked means reject uh, reject expression so here actually i am contain i am using csv file so i have marked them as a star dot star that means i have to pick up all the files then order by clause then by default you can see it provides four options by default by file name by file size by modified date and order option ascending or descending you can choose any one of them so i am uh, choosing ascending now file input so you can see that uh, uh, there is a property type building and schema i have already created a metadata data for project files like here like this you can see that and uh, the next this is the format of the file now you can see the I am going to uh, choose the fill separate as a comma and stand alone corresponding character by uh, backslash n and header is would be in the first row then finish it okay now actually when the input source is stream or retrieve file footer and random should not be bigger than zero so file name is stream because uh, every file have a separate uh, path so we are using t file list current file path uh, based on this situation you can see global variables so there are four basic global variables current file current path current file extension and current file directory current file return the file current file name current path current file path will return full path of the file a current file extension will return the current uh, extension of the file and current file directory the current file directory only so here now we have the output delimited now we are using the file name and we have created the uh, file at this location there is no file right now you can see that and for row separator we are using backslash n for the fill separator we are using comma separated then append all the rows and include header also we are using the same schema which we are using for file input delimited and now our package is ready now we are going to run this package now you can see this is the job history and this is the five rows and this is the timing now we are going to back our area now you can see all the data is going to append in this file so it is very easy to use uh, to load multiple files in a single file or in a sql data table please subscribe my channel on youtube for video for more videos on talent thank you for watching us